welcome sports fans to Um, Tunis, Tunisia. I'll have the starting lineups as soon as the players enter the court. Playoff system is best of three, which is leaves the clubs very little chance of error. In a five-game series, uh, you can be a little bit lax the first game because you have another potential four out of five games to win. But in a three-game series, game one becomes very important because if you win game one, you have an advantage. If you lose game one, you are at a disadvantage. And now the five players for Al Sad in white. Codage number 34. Newcomer, Devin Green, number 21. National team point guard, Mustafa Fuda, number four. National team power forward, Nasser Reyes, number 42. And I'm sure Dominique James will be the other starter. In Araby, in red, William Byrd, number 15. Khalid Gee, number two. National team star, Khalid Abdi, number 22. Omar Sake, number 14. And Kevin Galloway, number 23, rounds out the team for Al Araby. Officials are ready. Players are ready. We'll have the jump ball right now. Dominique James does his normal pregame ritual of jumping up and putting his head up to the same level as the rest, which is extremely expressive because impressive. Dominique James is about six feet tall. Nasser Reyes will jump against William Byrd. Oh, seems to have a delay. One player has his jersey outside of his pants, which is not allowed by FIBA international rules. Tip is up. First tip, possession goes to Al Sad. Dominique James brings it across, guarded by Kevin Galloway. That should be a good matchup. Two of the quality players in this league. Newcomer, Devin Green, first possession. James, James, shake, bait, jump shot on the mark. And Al Sad draws first blood to zero. Matchups Galloway guarded by Fuda. 
Tyler guarded by newcomer Devin Green. Tyler to the basket. Foul. Two shots. For Tyler Gee, national team player who just got finished with experience with the national team in qualifiers here in Doha. First foul. Against Al Sad Club. Still waiting for the player's number to be officially registered. Somehow I think it will be Nasser Reyes, but I'm not the official, and the official must make the official announcement. Foul is number 42, Nasser Reyes. Talagi will shoot two. Shot up and down. Tyler is a good young prospect, uh, about 21, 22 years old. Take his first national team experience over the last two months and is starting to pick his game back up. He ties the score at 2 2. Mustafa brings it across. They're going to run play two. And now there are some matchup changes. Dominique James guarded by Bird. Told it. James out. Mustafa Futa off the mark. Rebound. Omar Sink, who is the team's leading rebounder at Al Sad with 11 rebounds per game. And now Araby's running set. Galloway to the basket. Kicks it across. Tyler Gee from outside. Knocked it down for three. Talagi has all five points for our Arabi. Two on a foul shot and a three-point shot. Sad. Moving the ball around. Strip. Galloway against Green. Omar Sake, the bird. Assist Sake. Basket or dunk. William Bird and Al Arabi goes up 7 2, 8 minutes and 5 seconds in the first quarter. And now, matching up again. A lot of talking on defense, which is a great fundamental to have, the quality of a good defensive team. Toad it to the basket. Missed shot, rebound, Nasser Reyes, and follow, put back by Nasser Reyes. Warning, delay of game for Totich touching the ball after the ball had gone through the net. This is employed to stop the other team from getting the ball in bounds quickly and getting it up the court quickly. Tactic this seems to be employed defensively by Sack. Mustafa Fuda will guard Kevin Galloway. Anytime Galloway looks to take his height and experience to the basket, he's going to be doubled by Dominique James. And this just forced the turnover by Al Arabi. James, weave, weaving, Nasser Reyes off the mark. Rebound, Kevin Galloway. Calling for the screen, switches out. Galloway with the mid range. Down and Galloway puts Al Arabi up 9 4. And Arabi seems to be off to a good start, but we have a lot of basketball to be played. Tyler Gee guarding Devin, Jay, Devin Green. Dominique Jane misses a three. Galloway, Omar Sick in the low box. Same situation as before. He goes to penetrate. Sad doubles on the ball. They're looking to make the pass to the open cutter to the basket. That time the cutter being William Bird. Nice out of bounds play. Assist. Adi. Basket. Set. Time out for Al Sad.
first three minutes and a half seem to be working in favor of Al Arabi. But again, we have a lot of basketball to be played. We still have six minutes and 28 seconds left to go in the quarter. Timeout. Let's see what adjustments Coach Manus will make with Al Sag Club. In addition, watch to see if there's a change of defense for Al Arabi during this next possession. A lot of times you will see during a timeout uh, a strategy used by the offense, particularly if they need points and a change in defense, hopefully to kind of surprise the play that the offensive coach has designed on the sideline. The officials will now uh, pick, encourage the coaches to get their teams out the huddle, and we're getting ready to start action again with 6.28 left to go in the first quarter. Nasir Reyes inbound the ball. To Dominique James, listening to instructions from his coach. And now they'll match up again. Galloway on James. Reyes on Green. Omar Sek is just kind of zoning the basket. Staying between the ball and the basket. Cody to the outside. Closely guarded by Bird. Foul. William Bird. A bit too close. Good position on defense. Maybe a half a step too close to the offensive player. Told it his experience. Puts the ball down and drew the foul on Bird. And Coach Hatcham is not pleased by the call. Tough call. Toadich, medium range, looks around. Devin Green hasn't put up a shot yet. And now he's going to the basket. Lean and basket good. Devin Green, first shot in the QBS. Could be a possible basket and one. Kind of a floater moving into the lane from left to right. But we'll get a chance to see the new player or the new import by employed by Lau Sad throughout this playoff. Mr. Foul shot. 11-6, Al Arabi over Sad. Same scenario. They are double teaming all passes inside of four or five meters on the double team. If you look weak side, you have two players. Weak side being the side without the ball. You look low for the cutter or you look outside for the skip pass and jump shot. Mustafa into the lane, turn, nothing there. Travel, double dribble. Tyler Gee, guarded by newcomer Devin Green. Set. Pulls up. Shot is short. Off the front rim. Ball. Dominique James weaving in. Out. Totus with the three. Off the mark. Abdi with the ball. Khalid Suleiman Abdi, national team star. Omar with the drive, kicks it out. Tyler with the shot. Basket. Three. And foul after the shot. Tyler Gee seems to be bringing his A game to the court tonight. He already has more than half of the Al Arabi points. Substitution. Faisal Abuisa is in. Nasarius is out. Abdi with the shot. Off the mark. Swipe 
by Galloway on Totes to no avail. Both teams, a lot of switching on defense. Omar Sek is simply staying between the ball and the basket and not really guarding anyone. Bird to the rack, misses. Omar Sik with the rebound. Foul before the shot. It is Sad's third foul. Peso Abu Issa first. Abuisa. Tyler again. And ball went all the way down and out. Foul Tyler Gee, and he is not pleased by the call. But you have to ask yourself a question. What player accepts the facts that they make fouls on the court? The player is always right, and the referee is always wrong, but the referee has the final decision. Rujdi Khalid comes in the game, and now he's guarding the American, new American player, Devin Green. Faisal to the rack. Off the mark. Rebound, and here comes Araby. Pass intercepted by Green. Toad it. Basket three. Big man capable of going inside and outside. You have to locate him at all times in transition. And now, Araby cuts the lead to eight. Bird. Rujdi with the runner. Rujdi, offensive rebound. Rujdi stolen by. Oh, Green. Foul. Number 22, Abdi. That is Araby's fourth foul. Players first, Abdi. Teams fourth. Inbounded to Dominique James. James to Fuda. Fuda to Green. Green to James. James with the penetration. Cut off. Switch again. A lot of switching employed by the team in red. Turnover. Galloway. Abdi. Galloway calls out play three. Ten seconds left to go on the shot clock. Galloway. Back rim and out. Abuisa Fuda brings it across. Back to the corner. Issa. Fuda back out top at the slot. Low post. Green and Rusty. Double team Araby. Green turns baseline, knocks down the easy jump. Well, it was not an easy shot. Knocked down the jump shot. Score, 16 Araby, 10 Al Sad, 150 left. Bird, Omar Sick, assist, post to post. The teamwork between both post players. Seemed to be working well. Before, at the beginning, it was Sek to Bird. And this time, Bird returns the favor back to Omar Sek. A lot of switching going on on the court. Foul on outside. Devin Green, his second, team's fourth. Omar Sek, toss, did not go in. 
Mustafa, shot fake. Green one-on-one. -on -one. East out the corner. Basket. Wow. This kid came in mid-season. Babakar went out with an injury, and he stepped right in, and he's really doing an impressive job for Al Sag Sports Club. Bird off. Rush the end. Good finish with the left hand. National team player call it Rujdi. Offensive rebound and finish. Foul. Galloway on the dribble drive. In the bon the bonus, well, excuse me, Araby is in the penalty. Al Sad will shoot two. Dao will come in the game and sub out. Devin Green, Dao 23, in, Green out. Newcomer has made a pretty impressive start. Two fouls in the first quarter. He is adjusting to the officiating in the QBS. Dominique James knocks down the first. He brings Al Sad within six with 22.1 seconds left to go in the first quarter. Second one is up. Out. Off the hand of Bird. Substitution. Back. Green for Daoud. Dominique James will take it out for Al Sad. You could get another basket off of the mistake. Well, not mistake. Off of the tip out of bounds by Al Arabi. Green with the left and with the finish. Wow. Went to the basket, absorbed the contact, put it up with his left hand and finish. Six. Solid. Abdi with the shot. Rebound toted. At the score, at the end of the first quarter, Al Arabi, 20, Al Sad, 16. You are looking at QBF Basketball Channel, and this is the playoff for the QBF First Division Professional. Here. We're ready to start the second quarter. Score is Al Arabi 20, Al Sad 16. 
possession. We'll go to Al Arabi. Five players in red for Al Arabi. Rush D22, Bird 15, Ivy 22, Galloway 23, Set 14. In white, Abuisa 7, Totis 34, Green 21, Fuda 4, and Dominique James 14. Beautiful design play by our Araby to start the second quarter. And Sick could not find a handle with the ball. Ball out of bounds to Al Sad. Oh. Two straight missed layups by Al Arabi. Wow. And a foul on Khaled Rushdie out of frustration of missing the layup. Two easy opportunities to get baskets given away by our Arabi club. Low post to Todic. Todic working against Bird. Out to Fuda. Fuda with the dribble penetration. Issa again. Off the mark. Rebounded Bird. Bird to Abdi. Abdi back to Bird. Nine left on the shot clock. Galloway pulls up. Knocks it down. And Kevin Galloway could really have a big evening as long as the outside defenders try to guard him one-on-one -on -one with less experienced players. Up until now, when he bounces the ball, there's double teams coming. And this seems to be the defense employed by both teams. Allow the catch. As soon as the offensive player put it down, send another defender at the offense. Six seconds left to go on the clock. Green with the spin. Turn. Kiss the ball real nice off of the backboard. Devin Green, first time in the QBF, playing his first game, appears to be a, a very polished offensive player. Galloway off the mark with a miss. Miss. Abdi with the rebound. Khaled turns out to Khaled Rushdie. Rushdie with the penetration. Out to Bird. Out to Omar Set. Off the mark. Rebound. Told it. Neither team has gotten a lot out of their offensive set. Foul and basket. Rushdie caught low against Devin Green. Smart pass up in the air over top of the defense. Basket and foul. Sad cuts the lead to two. Timeout. Al Arabi. Devin Green, a newcomer to the QBF. This is his first game as a member of our SAG club from the United States of America. He has already half or 10 of the Al SAG 20 points. He replaced Russell Bird, who was also a pretty good player from the U.S. Uh, it's Bird. We had saw play three games in the QBF, and he appeared to be improving and getting better as each game went out. The outside staff perhaps thought that they needed a little bit different type of player, and seems like they've come up with the player in Devin Green. Al Arabi has gone with the three professionals. They will finish the end of the season with Galloway, with Bird, with Omar Set. A lot of times between the regular season and the playoff, and then the playoff and the cup. You see a lot of clubs beginning to switch plays. 
Some feel that that's the best philosophy to get themselves back in the winning way. Right now, uh, Devin Green is paying off big time for our side club with 10 of the 20 points, and he'll shoot one foul shot. Misses the shot. Araby still ahead, too. Mustafa Gouda guarding Kevin Galloway. Zone defense now employed by the outside. Araby picked it up. Bird with the attack on the basket. Foul on Todic. William Bird will shoot, too. Change of defense after the timeout. Mock pressure up the court between Fuda on Galloway. As soon as the first pass was made, then outside went into a matchup zone. Looked to be 3 2. Araby picked it up right away. Two passes into the post. Foul on William Bird. Bird makes one out of two to put Araby up 3 23 20. Totes with the shot blocked by Omar Set. Ball in the lane, retrieved by Al Sad. Missed three by Dominique. Rushdie with the steal on the attack. Foul, Mustafa Fuda bringing the ball up. A lot of action, but no baskets. <laughs> And now Tyler Gee will replace Khaled Rujdi. Araby looks to be staying inside the zone defense. Matching up on the perimeter with three small outs. Tyler Gee into the game. High low again. Traveling. Bird caught the ball, did not establish a pivot foot. So when he went to put the ball down, the official right away called the traveling call. Turnover for our Araby. And now Al Sag gets a chance to cut the lead to one. Dominique James to the basket. Defend it. No foul. And now a foul. On Abuisa, number seven. You know, the assortment of fouls are kind of different tonight. None of them were up under the basket. All of the fouls seem to be out on the court, 20, 25 feet away from the basket. Abdi, inside against Dominique James. Abdi turns, foul again, non-shooting foul. Foul on number 14, Dominique James. Team's third, his first. Team's fourth, his first. Shot up from outside by Abdi. Missed. Mustafa to the basket. To Dominique James. Slips. Slips. Look like he hurt himself. Cramp. Cramp. Hamstring, it appears. Could have been a wet spot on the floor or he just got himself out of position. Uh, tough injury for a player who depends on quick starts and explosiveness. Seems to be able to get up on his own pretty well, but needing help going off the court. Oh, and now the the cramp comes back again, and now he has to go back down. Bad break for Alsat. James still out on the court, being attended to. Let's hope this is not severe. This is a quality player for Alsat. 
just a great young man. Let's, let's hope for the best. Still being attended to by the medical staff of Alsat. Dominique James is still down. And now he gets a hand as he's being helped off the floor. Bad break for Al Sad if this injury is more than just a cramp. James brings leadership and one of the best fourth quarter fin game finishers in the QBF history. We've seen a lot of games over the past four years where this young man in the fourth quarter or the guts of the game or the crunch time has delivered. He leaves the game with three points and two assists. Into the game, national team player Nasser Reyes replaces Dominique James. Mustafa to the hole, to the basket. And Mustafa Fuda catches the defense sleep and attacks him to cut the lead to one point. Khalid Abdi, same spot, same result. No basket. Mustafa looking to be aggressive, one-on-one -on -one with William Bird, block. Bird is a first-class defender, one of the best defenders in the history of QBF. Wow. In and out, no call. Out of bounds, turnover by Alsat. Dominique James just walked by, and let's hope the best. Left hand finish again, missed. How many has Araby missed inside the semicircle? Sure, you 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 you, you have to, to give credit to their attack, but you also must finish when you attack. They've had four shots minimum right there inside the semicircle, inside the three-point lane, against the backboard that they have not made. Abdi fouled on, makes the first. And now, Araby will shoot in the bonus for the next four minutes and 29 seconds. Khalid Abdi makes the second. Timeout, Al Sad. Coach Manos now has to adjust his offense without leader Dominique James. But outside, they have a lot of interchangeable parts. Sure, you don't want to lose a player of the quality of Dominique James, but now chances are they will go to a bigger lineup. And let's see what other qualities uh, Devin Green brings to the table. 25 Al Arabi, 22 for Al Sad. This is QBF Basketball Network from Parafa Indoor Stadium. This is game one of the playoffs. This is game one, best of three of the playoffs. Best four teams will play best of three, one being Al Sad versus four being Al Arabi in the league standing. And in the second game, Al Shamal will play against Qatar Sports Club. 429 left. Al Arabi is up three. If you missed it, Dominique James has gone out, which looks to be either a strain or a pulled hamstring for Al Sad. Sad and White will go with Reyes, 42, Fuda, 4, Abuisa, 7, James uh, Green, 21, and Todich, number 34. 
young team. Three young players and two professionals. Deflection. Totich trying to make an inside cut. Trying to make a pass to an inside cut. Aloisa takes it out. Totich has the ball. Looking to isolate on William Bird. Spins. Turns. Shot at the basket. Foul on Bird. That is the Arabi's third. And number two on William Burke. Todich will shoot two. Good offensive player, good defensive player. Todich should shoot another one off the missed shot. Second shot, it lines up. Second shot up. Second shot rolls in. And now outside goes after the foul shot to a one, two, two, full court press. Easily taken care of. Quick shot. Quick basket. Talagi from the right wing. Three point shot. Do not know if the coach wanted that, but he wanted the result because the result is three. Green against Omar Sick. Inside Totich. One on one with Galloway. Turn. Slap on the arm by Kevin Galloway. Totich will shoot another two. So, if you have to have to, what, 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 what strategy would you be for out and out without Dominic James? It will be Totich as a playmaker for medium distance or from down inside the zone. That would be Galloway. Galloway on the switch, on the switch, post play versus the PG, advances out of the court for the PG, underneath the basket, advances to the post, shot blocked by Bird, Omar Sek up under the basket again, five, and this time, Pass inside is rewarded by the five against Nasa Ray. Omar Singh will do it. Ray is his third foul. Team is already over the limit. Arabi is shooting in the bone. First shot. Good Omar Singh. Go, 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 go. 
here at Garoppolo Indoor Stadium. Game one of the playoffs. Al Arabin with 33 points and Al Saad with 27 points. You are listening to QBS, Basketball, Basketball Station, here in Doha, Qatar. I look for press. press. If he makes it, he's back, back on. on. You make, make the second, second shot. shot. They are they not on the press. press. Walk the ball, ball up. up. They, they are man to man. Not enough movement out of the court for error. error. And now, now one guy gets stuck in the ball. ball. Somehow another the ball, ball went out of bounds to our Arab. And now the Arab event is giving the officials a hard time over something. You know when the playoff starts, everybody gets a little bit more excited about my possession up and down the game. Inside the game, because so every possession is important. And now, Sat Arabi brings it up. Khalid Abdi gets free. Abdi with the penetration, kicks it out to Rudy. Rudy puts up the shot. Rebound to Bartosz for Ray. Green, total, total, total. Rebound. A hard, a hard. One minute left, left to go in the game. game. They call on the what? Five. Five. Not Five. a smart Five. style at all. Eight. The player Five. is 25 Five. feet Five. out of the back. Five. B, you are Five. in the bonus. Five. C, this is your, this is your fourth, fourth foul. Five. Five. Shot up, missed the first one, he will get the second shot. shot. Missed the both. Dodged the bullet that time, Al Sack. Amar, Marty Green. Green, the Fuda. Fuda, the Nasaray. Traveling? Yes, sir. The referee was right behind the play. Again, if you has, it's better to establish one pivot foot than to catch the ball on both feet and have options. Options sound like an advantage, but if you pick up or slide the wrong foot, 
The officials in the QBF will call traveling. Hodge to the basket. I don't know exactly what that is. Turns up, come up shooting, and misses. Sad has a chance to cut the lead. Foul on Omar Saint as Todich cuts down the lane. Missed the first. We'll get another one. Get a second one. 21.5 left. He can cut the lead to two, three. Makes the second one. Substitution. Hodge out. Rujdi out. Galloway in. Bird in. Last possession, shot clock is off. Running it deep into the shot clock. Abdi, back. He's taken three of those, and this one goes in at the buzzer to bring the game 35 out Araby and 29 for Al Sack. You are listening to QBF basketball from Garafa Indoor Stadium. Game one of the league playoff between Al Arabi and Al Sad. 35 for Al Sad. 20, I mean, for Al Arabi, 29 for Al Sad.
Sound check. One, two, three. Sound check. Okay. Here are your critical halftime statistics for the game between Al Arabi and Al Sagra. Arabi has a enjoys a 35 to 28 lead. Al Sag Club is shooting 39% from the field. They've taken 19 two-point shots and made 10. They've taken nine three-point shots and only made one. 50% from the foul line. This is the reason possibly why they've only scored 29 points in the first half. The shooting percentage is down. Normally, this team is a high percentage shooting shooters from both inside and outside. Al Arabi is only shooting 37%, which is also down. And this is normal. Because whenever, not for our Arabi, for any two groups of teams to get together in game one of a playoff or the final game. So let me complete the Arabi statistics. They took 32 shots from two points, and they only made 12. This is 37%. They shot 8 of 19 for two. They have shot 4 of 13 from three. They have made 7 out of 10 foul shots which is good. But as you see, both teams perhaps are a little bit nervous because this is a very important game one of the playoff. Let's hope that in the second half, both teams will relax. Uh, the coaches have given their instructions for the third quarter. And let's see if the percentages plus the level of play goes up. 35 points is normal for Al Arabi. They average about 70 points per game. Excuse me, 78 points per game. 29 is low for Al Sad because they normally average 77 or 78 points a game. Both teams that scoring during the QBS season are between 78 and 80 points per game. So right now at halftime, with one having 35 and one having 29, the score is a bit low. Different reasons for that. It could be because both teams have scouted each other so well and they know each other so well that they're taking away the strength of the other team. But let's hope that the shooting percentages go up in the second half and we will have a very exciting third and fourth quarter. Not on the court is Dominique James, who went out with a hamstring injury midway through the first quarter. He will be sorely missed by Al Sack, particularly in the fourth quarter, which usually dominates play with his ability to knock down three-point shots, with his ability to take the ball to the basket, with his ability to force the defense to play him and leave opportunity for his teammates. As for Araby, Araby has played, uh, played to win the game. They've managed to do a little bit better inside, particularly with their high-low passing between Omar Say and William Byrne. Kevin Galloway has given them flashes. Tyler Gee came out the gate uh, and scored 10 of their first 20 points. And right now, they enjoy a six-point lead. We'll come back with the third quarter in about one minute. You are listening to QBF Basketball Network. We are playing in Garafa Indoor Stadium. This is playoff game number one, Al Arabi 35, Al Sad 29.
Welcome to the second half of the game between our Araby and our Sad. This is game one of the QBF playoff here in Garafa Indoor Stadium between the number one seed uh, Al Sad versus the number four seed Araby. This is a best of three series here in the QBF with the winner playing, moving on to the championship between the winner of the next two teams, which is the number two seed, uh, Cutter Sports Club, versus the number three seed, Al Shamal. Teams are on the court, getting their last minute instructions from their coach. Our side club is directly in front of us. So I managed to sneak in and cheat and find out and see exactly what they're preparing for this third quarter. Our Araby card, is, our Araby club is on the far end. And no way for me to, to sneak in and cheat and figure out what they're doing. At the half, neither team is shooting their normal, but less. Expect the shooting, less expect the shooting to come up in the third quarter. This passing me is Dominique James. It looks to me like he'll be out for the rest of the game. We really feel bad because, again, he is a quality individual, a great player, and one of the, the leaders within the Alsat sports team, when basketball team. Sitting on the bench now, he, Baba Carr, who was out with also a knee surgery. So you have two starters for our side out of the third quarter and out of the, right now, potentially for the playoff at the end of the season. Abuisa with four fouls will inbound. Abuisa, seven, two to four, Ray is 42, Green 21. Code is 34 in white for Al Sad. In red, Bird 15. Ivy 22. Galloway 23. Galloway. Off the mark. Ball out of bounds. Tried to be saved. By William Bird, ball out to Al Sad, down six, and possession. Tyler versus D two versus two to four. Galloway is in help position, doubled on all dribble penetration, and we've seen that employed by both teams. Blocked by Omar Six on the green penetration into the lane. Sad, man-to-man, -man, protecting the lane. No pressure. Abdi again, off the mark, and man, oh, man. I think they're really putting up too many shots from outside without trying to get something closer to the basket. Green to the rack. Off the mark. Foul on number 22, Khaled Abdi. Ball out of bounds on the side. College second, team first. Green will inbound to Mustafa Fuda. High screen, stop and go. Nasser Rias from outside. Rebound, Abdi. Neither team has been smooth with their offense. Kick ball by Toda. Ball out of bounds. To Al Arabi. Both teams have struggled with their plays. I mean, usually there's a lot of high screens, a lot of cuts, a lot of backdoor action. Neither team has done a lot with their offensive system. Abdi with the ball, Abdi with the lead. Reyes goes down. The official is not buying it. No charge. Abdi scores. Khaled Abdi, national team player. And the score should be 37, but it hasn't gone up on the board yet. Rebound, William Bird. 
turnover. Ball out of bounds. I don't know why the score is not 37. I don't still don't know why the basket is not good. Shot up from Abdi. Rebound. Ball out of bounds. Out set. Score still on the board. 35. Maybe it was a foul. 37. So that figure. Shot up by Todic. Out. Playoff game. Interesting. No one is in sync with how they normally play. Kevin Galloway forgets the plays and goes straight to the basket with the finger roll. Put that up. Put Araby up by 10. Green with the ball. Penetrate. Abuisa with the penetration to the lane. Stop. Back out to Reyes. Foul. Away from the ball. And not a good foul with 4.5 seconds left to go on the shot clock. And that will be Tyler's third. You cannot discredit his hustle. But the, the decision to foul with four seconds left to go has put him on the bench. And he's been a pretty good offensive player. High screen. Green off the mark. Toted rebound. Tries to throw it off Bird. Bird takes it to Abdi. You know Tyler's going to the basket. Foul by Mustafa Fuda. Abdi will shoot two. Timeout. Al set. That is the second team foul on Sad and the second team foul on number four, Mustafa Fuda. And Sad is finding some problems to get any type of offensive rhythm without Dominique James in the lineup. 29 points. With 6.53 left to go in the third quarter is not their normal capacity. But again, when you look at the players who are on the court with them now, they are all basically new guys playing together. Abuisa came in the middle of the year. Green came about two or three days ago. So you basically have Reyes and Toted, Fuda for outside had been a mainstay all season. Araby, basically no changes. Bird has been there. Rushdie's been there. Uh, Stake has been there. Galloway came about a, three weeks, about a month ago. But he's played in the QBF before. Abdi has been there. So what you have is a team that's been working together most of the year against a team that's been only together basically for the last four to five days. Let's say three days. Because you have to remember that uh, Reyes, number 42 in white, and Foda, number four in white, were national team players and just finished qualifiers. Shot up, shot down. Abdi. Is a point. Seems like more, but the scoreboard says eight. I have to honor the scoreboard. Makes the second one. Gives him nine points. Full court pressure employed by Araby. Rouge D against Soda. Trying to find rhythm inside the total. Add double team from the weak side, post to post. And now Mustafa spins. To the lane. Hustle by Nasser Reyes. Ball out of bounds. Sack. 2.7 on the shot clock. Ball out of bounds. Sack. Who will take the ball out? Footer will take the ball out. 2.7 left. Shot up. Rebound set. To Abdi. Abdi brings it out, looks it over, reverses, long, skips it. Foul. And if that is Abdu Issa, that is five. 
and he's gone. And I heard the second whistle. When a whistle is that sharp, normally, that's a technical foul. <laughs> Abuisa goes out with five fouls, three points for his efforts. And now on the foul line, Khalid Abdi is shooting. Shot up. Shot is down. And now Abdi is up to 10 points. Ball out of bounds. Two. Wow. Wow. So the foul must not have been a shooting foul. He only took one shot, which was the technical. Abdi to the basket, kicks it back out to Galloway. Galloway with the three, off. Ooh. Bird with chasing the ball, Totus with the rebound. And Sad needs a bucket right now. Kick ball, and again, Green is new to the offensive system. And the coach and players are trying to give him a, a, a on-the-court uh, workshop on what the system is, on-the-court tutorial of what the system is. Another turnover by Al Sat, and they are offensive totally out of sync. Daoud is in Fabuisa, which gives him another player who has not been on the court with this particular group. Abdi. Abdi dribbles, spins, inside, double team again. Steal by Reyes, blocked by Todic, foul by, he has a choice. He took Rushdie for the foul. It could have been Rushdie, it could have been set. Both players made sure that Totus did not get the ball to the ring for the potential three-point play. Totus will shoot two. That is foul number three on Rudy. That is the third foul on Al Arabi. Team foul. Three fouls on the player. Three fouls on the team. Totus, Al Sad misses the first shot. Second shot is up. Second shot is down. And now the lead is 12. Abdi brings it across against Green. Green to sec out on the court. No spacing and no movement. A little bit of movement. Abdi to the hole, to the basket. Calls for a foul. Knocks it off the glass. Well, apparently, Coach Hatton understands exactly where his players should be on the court. Assist by Green. Dunk two hands by national team player National Ray. That also keeps the lead at 12. And now a little bit more ball movement and body movement by the Arabi. Bird inside. Set. 4-3. Fade away jump shot. Misses. Bird with the rebound, second shot, and rebound it. And William Bird for our Arabic, giving Bird seven points. Green, looking for the player rolling. Again, if you are not in practice a while with your players, it takes a while for the teamwork to come. Galloway misses, foul underneath, on. Devin Green, push, out of bounds. That is the third foul on Green and the third foul on Al Sad. Daoud will come out. Ibrahim Saidi is in. Off the backboard. Omar 
State with the jump shot. 32 for Sack, 48 for Araby. And now a lot of new faces out on the court for Al Sack. Green. Intentional foul on Green after the steal by Abdi. That will be his fourth foul. And that will be the team's fourth foul also. So, Araby will shoot in the bonus for the next 335. Intentional foul or unsportsmanlike foul. Abdi will shoot. First shot up. Down. Khalid Abdi and the points are starting to come. And now he's up to 13. You heard me say about 97 seconds ago, he only had seven. And now he's starting to pick it up. Ball bounces off the ring and out. Ball out of bounds to Araby. Abdi out. Khalid in. CJ is in. Basket by Bird. And now... The lead is 19. And now Green will need to shoot it every time he gets it. And there's one. Rebound Galloway. And now the push game. Offensive foul, I believe. And the offensive foul is what the call is. Great position by Mustafa Fuda getting his feet in front of Kevin Galloway. And now I think Galloway has four fouls. Galloway's fourth, so he'll have a seat. Now, in red, the team is Tyler G2. CJ 20, Abdi 22, Bird 15, Sex 14. I stop a play. Official goes to the table. Have a meeting with the table. Really don't understand what that was all about. Officials confirming with the table. He has his answers. Ball out of bounds has to be to our sack. They've only scored three points in the third quarter. And now they have a lot of new uh, definitely the first time of the year this combination has been on the court. Toted, guarded by Burt. When he dribbles, it'll be a double team. CJ, I mean, Mustafa with the penetration. Foul on CJ. Araby is over the limit. Sad will shoot. Christian Casas, CJ as we call him, foul against Mustafa Fuda. Mustafa took a warning from the official. Mustafa knocks down the shot. Young man has grown up a lot in the last year inside the QBF. And now he's a quality point guard. He's a national team starter and he earned his strike. A couple years ago, people left him open to shoot. You can't leave him to shoot now. His leadership qualities have, have grown, and he has a bright future in the QBS and a good future for outside sports club. Skip pass. Bird versus Nasser. Bird misses. Green rebound. Bringing up in transition. Both teams in the bonus. Good left hand. Did not make it. Omar Sick with the rebound. And now, Araby. 
shot clock is down to 16. Taking their time. Looking at the mismatches. Mismatches, they have a lot on the court now. And Tyler Abdi, this very poor decision. Took the ball to no man's land and passed to no one. Very poor possession. Kid, player of that experience, knows now. All you want is ball movement and body movement. You have a 17-point lead. Make your opponent guard everybody on the court, all over the court. You can take shots with six, seven, or eight seconds left to go on the shot clock, get back on defense, and have control of the lead and the game. The more you dribble when you have the lead, the easier it is for your opponent to help against you defensively. Mustafa with the penetration, five. And Mustafa Fuda has decided that he's going to be Dominique James. And that's what he looks like. Dominique James at this point in the game, usually in the fourth quarter, will just put his head down. Maneuver left, maneuver right, and get the ball to the basket. Fuda shooting two. First one is down. And now, outside is down 16. 154 left. Second one up. Second one off the rim. Rebound, Tyler Gee to CJ. CJ, Tyler. Real slow getting into the offense. Real slow. CJ, short shot, tough angle, short corner, basket, pass ahead, block by Omar C. Passes up, slow pass again. Mustafa putting his will, got himself out of control that time. Oh, kick ball. Nasa Reyes, out of frustration, technical foul. And now, frustration is a set in. And now, players are barking at the official. Reyes out, Buddha out, Green in, Daoud in. Toadage in. Sadie in. And they're losing their cool. Tyler goes to the foul line. Knocks down the technical. Ball out of bounds to Al Arabi. Up 19 points. Inbounded. Tyler versus Green. To CJ. To Bird. Good movement by Araby Club. Take with the shot. Ah. Codage invited him to shoot. He shot it. Missed. Horn set. He'll look to come off the screen by either Todage or Daoud. He comes off Todage's side. Daoud gets the ball back. Green out front. Basket. Three-point shot. The question is for our side. The point must come from Todich and Green. Rujdi to the basket. Ball taken. Outside two straight possessions. And now, again, Green, two-point shot, five straight shots, and good rhythm on that jump shot. Perhaps seeing the first one goes in, Going in, gave him confidence for the second. Bird with the penetration. Bird goes up. Walk. Point one is left. William Bird had the ball up on the left side. No need to go right. Clock is off. The end of the third quarter. Al Arabi, 54. Al Sad, 40. This is game one of the QBF playoffs. From Garafa Indoor Stadium. Yeah, 
Okay, we are prepared to start the fourth and final quarter of game one. Al Sad is down 14 points. They have number nine, eight, Daoud, 13, 23, sorry. Cody, 34, and Green, 21. Galloway, Abdi, Abdi, basket. And now Khalid is up to 16, 15 points. Green with the ball. They will run horns, two screens up top. He comes off the second one. Ahmed with the shot off the mark. Good looking shot. Hustle. Tatala. And now Araby will run their play. Straight up. Oh, come on, Bird. That's too easy. Come on, Bird. Little walk and finish with the left hand. The lead is still 14. Abdi, set. Dribble handoff inside the Galloway, straight up. Give and go. Miss. Araby is a little cute, too cute on offense and coming up with no bucket, so no result. I don't mind you being cute, but you have to come up with a bucket or score. Young man with the ball, penetration. Against Abdul Sheikh, block, shot clock, reset. Galloway brings it across. No call. Talab out front, and Araby is playing sloppy. Timeout, I'm sure, by Coach Hatton. This is the worst they've looked. And they have the lead, control of the ball, control of the clock, block shot. And the level of play has dropped continuously. Bird. Basket. And now Coach Hatton gets rid of his timeout with the score. 58. Al Araby, 42, Al Sad. Green. Dribbles the ball the entire 24 second clock. Drew the foul on Galloway, it looks like. That should be Galloway's fourth. <laughs> In fact, it's Galloway's fifth. That is all this evening for Kevin Galloway. He finishes with 11 points. Number of assists, 
Green misses the first shot. Man, has Al Sad been very unlucky scoring points tonight? Makes the second one. Newcomer Devin Green. 43 points for Al Sad. 58 points for Araby. Abdi off the board. Stolen by Kyle Gee. Foul by Nasser Reyes. Omar Sheikh will shoot. Two. Four on Reyes. Timeout. Arabic. Sad was, was very unfortunate to lose Dominique James in the first quarter. Seems like the a lot of the top confidence of the team went down from that point. And James came back at halftime with street clothes on, so he will be out. Looks to me like a strain or poor hamstring. The shooting percentage has been low, about 33%. They've averaged about 13 points. <clears throat> per quarter, and it's just not enough. But you know, you, you the game is not over until the last buzzer goes off. There's still 6.49 to play. They're down 15 points. Al Arabi played a good third quarter and now also seems to be uh, not playing at the same level to start the fourth quarter. They have a lead of 15 on the court for Arabi. It's CJ number 20, Tyler number two, Khaled Abdi 22, Omar Sek 14, uh, William Bird 15. This team was a staple last year when Araby won the championship. So they do have guys who have been used to playing with each other out on the court now. Sek puts up the first one and makes it. Whereas Sad has a number of new players. The professional player, new player Green, maybe two days. Uh, Daoud, not a lot of playing time this year. Uh, Todic here. Fuda is back. Reyes is back. They are down 17, 6.43 left. Todic versus the double team. This has been the employment all day by Arabic. Buddha off the mark. Rebound CJ. CJ on the attack to Tala. Tala to Abdi. Abdi to CJ. And now Araby will run off it <laughs> to the wing. High screen. Should go low post. Missed him. Went up with a shot. Knocked it down. CJ. Kasset. Kasset. Cash comes off the bench, knocks down his second shot. Fuda brings it across. Daoud will put it up. Look, good looking shot off the mark. Rebound, Abdi. And now the clock is starting to work against Al Sad. 5.35 left, and they look to be in a 2 3 zone right now. Tyler with the dribble, Bird with the follow, and now everything seems to be going the way of our Arabic Sports Club as they go up 21 points. 514 left. Buddha inside the green. Watch the double team, which he came. They're going to let Daoud shoot. Daoud has not had a lot of time this year. Ball bounced off of his hands into the hands of 
Call it up, dude. Moving it around. Omar sizes up the shot. Had too much time to shoot. And the ball was off. Green with the ball. Off the mark. Tip dunk by Nasa Reyes on the follow. Arabi up 19. Taking their time. Abdi up with a shot. And that is his spot. And he's knocking down the three, the shot that he was missing earlier in the game. His point total is now 21. Mustafa Fuda with the ball. The Nasa. Nasa back to Fuda. Fuda against CJ. Totus with the three, blocked by Bird. 345 left. Behind the back pass. Abdi to Al Sad Club. Totus to the basket. Puts it up. Misses. Goes back up. Foul. Omar Sheik. Daoud is out. Omar Abdul side is in. Todich makes the first shot. He has one more. 331 left. Second shot is good. And now time is the enemy of Al Sad. Rushdie missed shot. Rebound, Omar, taken away by CJ. He's been on the bench cold for a while, so he's not into over the speed of the game. A little bit nervous. The young kid out there in the playoff game, fresh off the bench. No problem. He's going to get better. Offensive foul, Woodsy. Dribble penetration to the basket. Ruggie's had a frustrating evening, but no problem. His team is ahead on the score. That's all that's important. That's his fourth foul. Team third foul. Uh, Mustafa Fuda brings it up against C.J. Casas. Inside the green. Green up quick. Jump shot is in. And now... The best thing would be is let Devin Green uh, find his way here in the QBF and learn the basket and just learn how the officials are going to call the game and how the teams are going to defend it. Tyler Gee is up. Dribble drive. Skipped it. CJ. Rushdie. Rushdie. Off. Rebound. Nasa Reyes. Green to Totus. Totus with the basket. And foul. Foul number five on Tyler Rushdie. Rushdie has had a frustrating game with two points only, uh, five fouls. Um, what's important, his team is ahead 16 with 211 left. He's a, he's a young player. He, he's a national team player. Uh, habits of young players are being up one day and down the next. Uh, I, I promise you, you're going to hear good things from Tyler Rushdie for our Araby club throughout this playoff. Omar Sheikh to Tyler Gee. To Omar Al Hodges in the game. Foul. Push against Al Sad. Game. Reyes finished the game with six points. All dunks. 
five fouls. Tyler with the shot, pull up. Foul on Totich. On the jump shooter, he'll shoot three. Stops the clock. 137 left. Tyler Gee, another national team young player for the Arabi Club, makes the first. A lot of young national team players uh, are, are taking experience this game. Makes the second. You got Tyler Gee and Rushdi for the Arabi. You have Nasser Reyes, Mustafa Kuda for Al Sad. It's good that these kids or young players get a chance to play heavy minutes in the in the league play. Oh, good move. Oh, oh. He took him left. He took him right. He went up. And the defender went up. He went down and dunked it. Nice move by Devin Green. As I told you, now is Green's t- t- opportunity to just get a feel for the league. DJ to Omar, give and go. Out to Tala, no call. Green again, green again, draws the foul and the basket. <laughs> and like I said, great opportunity for him just to break himself into the league. And he's starting to put points up on the board in a big way. He has 25, looking for 26. And there's your 26 point from Newcomer. First game in the QBS. Devin Green, 53 seconds left. And Araby with the ball and the lead. CJ with the ball up and knocks it down again. And CJ. It's taking three jump shots from outside, knocks him down. Mustafa with the lead, uh, with the dribble, takes the ball to the basket, scores. Mustafa, what, CJ is having word. Dribbling the ball out. I don't really take to this. I figure you ought to play the game until the game is finished. There's eight seconds left. Eight seconds. Don't foul him. He finishes with the dunk. Coded. Uh, the final score. Game one of the playoffs between Al Arabi and Al Sad. 71 for the winners. Al Arabi and 60 for Al Sad. This is game two. We'll come up shortly between Cutter Sports Club and Shamal. Thank you very much for your attendance. And goodbye from Garafa Indoor Stadium.